the hot air balloon was the first flight technology to carry humans into the sky. Washoe County proudly carries on this tradition with their partnership with the Great Reno Balloon Race. The county is proud to host the largest free hot air ballooning event in the world at Rancho San Rafael Regional Park. It's a great event in one of our signature parks, Rancho San Rafael. This is a great facility. Every September, for the last 33 years, the annual event has dazzled locals and attracted pilots from around the globe. A lot of balloon races actually charge the public to get into the grounds where the balloons are setting up. So it's one of the few events in the country that is uh, free to the public. WCTV followed pilot Lewin Williams and got a behind the scenes on getting up in the air. And they always say, your first balloon ride is your cheapest. The second one cost you about 80,000. <laughs> Beyond the spectacle, there is hard work and dedication. As the sun makes its debut at dawn, crew members rally around the balloons and learn the ropes. I absolutely love it. I look forward to this weekend every year. The vantage point from the air is truly one of a kind. The air is peaceful and the view of our region is majestic. You love it so much, you get up here and you enjoy it. and It's just very relaxing. Throngs of people attend the event, but for Washoe County and the organizers of the Great Reno Balloon Race, it's all about safety. Reno should be proud of the fact that the, the people here are concerned about their safety and the safety of the pilots. Williams makes safety a priority as well. Uh, every time we fly, we safety check everything. The crew participates in that, but the responsibility of that inspection is the pilot. And he passes his knowledge onto our children at a Washoe County School District event each year when he visits. The most important thing I want to explain this morning is about the safety. Needless to say, the kids love it. The balloons float throughout Northwest Reno. Residents wave and cheer as they pass overhead. For those new to the race, it's a special experience. You know, I asked him um, in the backyard there, you know, where are you gonna land? And he said, I don't know. <laughs> but then they landed here. So we're all excited. However, for the chase team, it's a different story. They're on a mission to locate their balloon. And when the crew cuts to the chase, things heat up. There he is, I see him. After a successful and safe landing, the crew breaks down the balloon. It's time to pack it up. Then you're pulling up the tarp. Last thing we'll do is we'll mount this basket, which was inside the van. We'll now mount it on the uh, lift gate for the rest of the event. And by noon, most of the action has subsided. But the thrill of flight remains. I couldn't have felt more safe today. It was an awesome ride. With the weekend coming to a close, Washoe County Manager John Slaughter looks to the future of the Great Reno Balloon Race and its home at Rancho San Rafael Regional Park. It's really exciting. It's a partnership with the balloon races. Hopefully it'll keep the event here in the park forever and ever for, for us all to enjoy. For this partnership, the sky is the limit.